is Dr. John Runback from American Endovascular and Amputation Prevention. Why does PAD lead to amputation? So PAD or peripheral artery disease is when art, the arteries in the legs get blocked by plaque or hardening of the arteries. The same process which can affect the heart arteries where it's called coronary artery disease and result in heart attack. In the legs, when you have some mild blockage, you may just get some pain when walking when the muscles demand increased blood flow, but that demand can't be met due to these blocked arteries. However, in more severe conditions, with more blockages, blockages of more arteries or longer blockages in the legs, you get to a point where there's insufficient blood flow, even at rest, and you may have pain that wakes you at night, or you may develop wounds or even gangrene that don't heal. If you have that condition, which is called critical limb ischemia, obviously it's a very serious situation. If you get gangrene, that leads to amputation due to insufficient blood flow. Here at American Endovascular and Amputation Prevention, we specialize in restoring blood flow, even in the most complex cases, even when many other doctors might have failed or said that amputation is necessary. And in more than 80% of cases, we can open up the arteries and prevent a major amputation.